All right, Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rechakwadash. Double honors to my apostles and that great millstone who do rule and teach well. And peace and salutations to all you I came out there pushing this truth across the four winds so we can seal the elect and make it to the kingdom. All right, it's the brother Yorah, Lord willing, coming back to you through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, to feed the body and edify the sheep in all spirit, faith, truth, sincerity, and doctrine. All right. The Heavenly Father's name or the correct name of the Heavenly Father is Yahweh, okay, which means he is or he's to be, all right, the Alpha and Omega, man, all right, and the correct name of his son, all right, which is a separate God, a separate entity, all right, his son's name, his son's correct name is Yahweh Shai, all right, Yahweh Shai, which means he that saves or he that delivers, okay, and he is the, he is the only way to salvation and deliverance, man. Okay, especially for us Israelites, man. All right, you so called blacks, Latinos, Native, and Seminole Indians. All right, you see the title? It's uh, Yahweh Shai is the way. All right, I just want to do a quick lesson through the spirit and power of Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai. And Lord willing, this is edifying to the body and defeats the sheep through the spirit and power of Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai. All right, so you see the uh, precept that I have here on the screen. All right, I was watching the brother's lesson, and uh, through his lesson, you know, you know, that uh, sparked my spirit to actually do this lesson. All right. So this is the book of St. John, chapter 14 and verse uh, six. All right. And it reads, Yahweh Shai saith unto him, I am the way. All right. The truth and the life. No man cometh unto the father, Yahweh, right? But by me. Which is Yahweh Shai, all right? Remember, Yahweh Shai is the uh, mediator between the Heavenly Father and men, okay? Not just any men, all right, but the Israelite men, okay? All right? And we must, you know, get to the Heavenly Father, all right, through His Son, Yahweh Shai, man. That's the only way, all right? Because Yahweh Shai is the way, all right? But He's the truth, okay? He is the truth, man, okay? And if you say that you're in the truth, all right, then you have to be tapped into Yahweh Shai, man. Okay. You cannot say that you're in the truth and, you know, not represent or come in the spirit and power of Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, man. All right. That's what that's what it means. Yahweh, the Heavenly Father, Bahashim, in the name of, right, Yahweh Shai, the Son. Okay. All right. There's no other way, man. All right. There was no other way. All right. Inside joke. All right. But when you go into that way, it's so like when you go into that word all right, or that phrase, the way. Right. It's the Greek word. Uh, hodos. All right. Lord willing, I'm pronouncing that correctly. But hodos. All right. And you see what it means. Let's go down to the outline. OK, it says properly. All right. A way. A traveled way or a road. Right. A traveler's way journey or traveling. OK. Excuse me. All right. And that's why we follow men. All right. That have traveled or that have experience in this truth, man. All right. And that being our apostles and our el and, and our elder brethren. OK. You see, but starting with our apostles, man, of great millstone, man. OK. Those men, you know, these men have traveled, man, and, and, and are still traveling, man, still out there doing the work. You know, still being, you know, tried by the Heavenly Father through his son, Yahweh Shai, man. Okay. You see? And still striving, man. All right? And that's inspirational. Okay? All right? But let me get this uh, precept really quickly. All right, it's the book of uh, Sirach or Ecclesiasticus, chapter 34 and verse, I'll start at verse 9. All right? And it reads, A man that hath traveled knoweth many things. All right. And that's why our apostles and elders are, are, are able to teach, you see, because they have been there, man. That's why you hear the apostles and elders, you know, uh, uh, um, you know, give their testimonies and their stories. All right. Those are th those are, you know, things that they have learned through through their travel and this truth. OK, it says, and he that have much experience will declare wisdom. OK. And that's why a lot of wisdom that that's why our apostles and, el and, and uh, elders have, you know, much fruit, you see, in this truth, man. All right. Because because of their travels 
and their experiences, all right, they declared wisdom, okay? And that and and, and, and because they declared wisdom, they, they sprouted up a lot of fruit, okay? You see? Verse 10 it says, He that have no experience knoweth little. You see? And 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 look, you can apply that to these guys, you know, th these uh so called Israelites and it's truth, man. Okay. All right, these leaders, these commanders, these bishops, you know. All right, these guys that 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 have declared that they that that they are the, uh, you know, the uh, the uh, the uh, the uh, top, the new top dog in the truth. You know, these guys don't have wisdom, man. Okay, all right, they don't have a hundred percent truth, man. Okay, that's why you see them sprouting out. You know, these uh these are wayward doctrines, man. Okay, all right, Yahweh Shai, uh, uh, um, uh, uh, um, did witchcraft, you know. Uh, uh, um, um, there's no such thing as the chariots being the UF, you know, the so-called UFOs, man. You see, uh, uh, um, there's no miracles, you know, and et cetera, et cetera, man. Okay. All right. Declaring other names. Okay. That's another thing, man. Okay. A lot of these guys aren't in the truth because they're not in the way they don't come in the name or the spirit of Yahweh Shai, man. Okay. That's how, you know, a lot of these guys, they're not in the truth, man. OK, so like, I don't mean to go off, you know, go off topic a little bit. But, you know, that's that's a, you know, an important thing to point out, man, in this truth, man. OK, you see, because we are guided by the spirit and power of Yahweh Shemi Shai, man. OK, wisdom guides us, man. OK, that's how we're able to point these guys out and say through through the spirit, these guys are off. They're not coming in the way of Yahweh Shai, man. Okay. They're not, they're not, they're technically not in the truth. Just like two thirds of our own people, man. Okay. Two thirds of the Israelites, man. All right. Because they're not coming in the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. That's why they don't declare the names, man. Okay. And the names are important for, our, for, you know, for our salvation. Let me repeat the names of the Heavenly Father Yahweh and his son Yahweh Shai are very vitally important. All right. To the salvation of of us, you know, the hopeful elect, you see, so lucky, let me continue the book of Sirach or Ecclesiasticus chapter 34 and verse uh, 10, he that have no experience knoweth little, but he, but he that have traveled is full of prudence, all right, and that's our apostles and elders of great millstone, verse 11, when I traveled, I saw many things, and I understand more than I can express, see, all right. Lots and lots of wisdom, man. OK, you should be you. You should want to be in the presence of men that 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 declare wisdom, man. All right. That that have traveled, that have much experience, man. So much that they can't even tell you everything, man. OK. You're going to you're going to have to you're going to have to sit down with these men, you know, you know, time and time again. You see, that's why the scripture says what? Uh, Where out the doorsteps of thy teachers, man. OK. So, so, so that you can what? So that you can get some of that wisdom, man. You see? This is verse uh, 12. It says, I was oftentimes, okay, or I was oft times uh, in danger of death, okay? Yet I was delivered because of these things, see? Because of what? Because of the experience, the experience of traveling in this truth, man, okay? All right? They, you know, the, uh, our apostles and elders have have, have uh, made mistakes, have seen other men make mistakes in this truth, man, and in, 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 uh, in this walk. OK, the Lord has revealed things to our apostles, and the, uh, you know, our apostles and elders and elder brethren, you know, that watch over our souls, man. OK, you see, and that's why they can let us know off top. Hey, look, brother, you, 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 you headed down this road. If you don't fix your pride or if you don't fix, you know, uh, 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 um, you know, your uh, lust for the woman or, you know, your lust for this or, you know, you know, w you know, whatever, whatever the case may be, you know, if you don't, if you don't, if you don't, you know, pr fast and pray, you know, and, 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 and uh, correct that, that's going to be your downfall, you know. That's why brothers tell us that, man. OK, because why? Because they have traveled. They have experience. OK, they have made those mistakes or they've seen other men make those mistakes. That's why they warn us of the dangers. You see. Uh, verse 13, it says the spirit of those that fear the Lord, Yahweh shall live. See, 
for their hope is in him, Yahweh Shai, right? That saveth them. See, Yahweh Shai, he that saves, he that delivers. See? Now let's go back. All right. This word uh, uh, for the way. All right. The Greek word uh, uh, hodos. Okay. Let's read this second outline a uh, 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 definition. Okay. It says metaphorically speaking. All right. A course of conduct. Okay. So so if if, if Yahweh Shai is if Yahweh Shai is the way, right? And we're walking in that same way. All right. As Yahweh Shai. Right. Then our conduct must be a certain type of way. You see, it says a way, i.e. manner of thinking. All right. A way of thinking, a way of feeling, a way of deciding. See. All right. That's why the scriptures say this. All right. All right. Yahweh Shai is going to guide our steps. OK, he's going to guide us in this truth, man. OK, you know, and, and, and you know, Lord willing, all the way until, you know, uh, uh, um, we, you know, we meet him, man. All right. Whichever way we, you know, you know, you know, the Lord has our path, man. OK, Lord willing, we keep walking in the way of Yahweh Shai. All right. In our conduct and in our manner and in our, you know, decisions. Right. Until we meet the Lord. You see. But this is the book of Isaiah, chapter 33 and verse uh, six. And it reads and wisdom and knowledge. See, that's the way. All right. That's the conduct. That's the mindset. All right. That's what's going to help us uh, uh, guide us in our decisions. All right. In our way of walking, in our way of life every single day. All right. Especially in the times to come. man. All right. Which the which which the scriptures. All right. Have said that it's going to be a time like no other man. All right. Very dangerous. OK, a very dangerous time, man. All right. But guess what? We 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 have no fear because we know that the Lord is guiding us, man. OK. And wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times, man. OK. Our mental stability, man. OK. Our our conduct, man. OK. Our decision making. All right. That's what's going to guide us, man. All right. Yahweh yeah, Shai. It says and strength of salvation. See. All right. It says the fear of the Lord, Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, is his treasure. OK, that's what we treasure the most, man. OK, in this truth. All right. The book of Proverbs, chapter 20 and verse 24. A man's goings are of the Lord, Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai. See? So, so, so everything that we do, man. OK, we know that there's no, uh, you know, coinkadink, as the people in the world say, or coincidence. There's no coincidences, man. OK. Everything happens to us for a reason, man. OK, to teach us something, man. We're supposed to learn something, man. OK, hell, even back in the world, you know, before I came into this truth, man, before the Lord called me into this truth. OK, I always had that mindset of, hey, you know, uh, uh, you, you learn something new every day. You know, you go through something every single day and you learn from it. You're supposed to learn from it, man. OK. All right. But only a man. All right. And when I say a man, I mean a man. You can only truly be a man if you are in this truth, man. OK, all the rest of these men, these so-called men that, you know, are, are Israelites. All right. But they don't accept that they're Israelites. Right. Two thirds. They're not really men. OK, that's why they get caught up in emotions and women and money and greed and, and, and lust. Right. But only a real man. OK. Would think this way, man. OK, a prudent man. All right. So also, let me get this here. This is the book of St. Matthew, chapter seven. All right. And verse uh, 13 and 14. All right. And it reads, enter ye in, in at the straight gate. OK. And that word straight, as you can see, all right, is spelled. It's not spelled uh, uh, um, um, straight as in a straightforward direction. Right. Or a straightforward line. Right. But straight as in a position of difficulty, man. OK, because you're going to have to go through hell in this truth, man. OK, as it is written. OK. All right. Matter of fact, let me see if I can grab it. I know it's in Ecclesiasticus. I think it's chapter two, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. Yep. Khan. All right. 
book of Sirach or Ecclesiastes chapter two and verse one. OK, it says, my son, if thou come to serve the Lord. So once you come into this truth, man, OK, this is what this is. This is a job. You have been hired. We have been hired to do the work of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. All right. But this is what comes with the job. Right. This is what the Lord is telling us. All right. If my son, if thy come to serve the Lord, prepare thy soul for temptation. OK, so you're going to go through hell. You're going to go through temptations. OK, you're going to have to fight demons, man. OK, you got to fight the flesh. All right. Your spirit is going to have to be enhanced and exercised in this truth, man. OK. All right. If you want to walk in the way, which how shy is the way. Right. Then if you want to walk in the way, you're going to have to. Uh, uh, um, uh, um, you know, go through a position of difficulty, man. Okay, the straight gate. Okay, so let's go back. Book of Saint Matthew, chapter seven, and verse thirteen. Enter ye in at the straight gate. Okay, so those that uh, those of us that are sincere in His truth, you know, Lord willing, we are sincere in the eyes of the Lord. Okay, and we continue to be sincere. All right. It said we have to walk through the straight gate, that position of difficulty, man. Okay. Because guess what, man? Matter of fact, let me keep reading. Let me keep reading. For wide is the gate and broad is the way. All right. See, see the gate, the uh, straight gate is narrow. Only one man can walk in one at a time. man. OK, but that wide gate. See, that's the easy way, man. You can easily walk through that gate. OK. All right. That's the that that's the two thirds of the nation of Israel, man. OK, that's these niggas and niggets out here, man. OK. These bad bees and, you know, thoughts out here, man. OK, they like it the easy way. They like the smooth things of life. OK, they love the world. You see. That's that's that that's that broad gate, man. OK, it says that leadeth to destruction. That's exactly where they're headed to, man. Destruction. OK, and you see our people, you see our people being judged more and more every single day, especially the women. OK. It says, and many there be which, so like, and many there be which go in thereat, okay? Many people, okay? Because remember, two thirds is, is, is greater, okay? Which, which means more than the remnant, okay? The one third, all right? The elect, okay? And the Lord is only here for the elect, the remnant, okay? Verse 14, it says, because straight, or that position of difficulty, right? Because straight is the gate and narrow is the way which leadeth unto life and few see that remnant. Right. And few there be that find it. OK. Only few, man. All right. You see. And that's why we're supposed to uh, walk on eggshells in this truth, man. OK. We're supposed to walk with fear. OK. The fear of not being a part of that number, man. OK. Uh, uh, the fear of not being a part of that 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 remnant, that few. All right. That are going to receive life. All right. When it's all said and done, man, that crown of life. Right. Let's continue. All right. Book of St. Matthew also verse 20. It's like a chapter 22, verse nine and 10. And it reads, go ye therefore into the highways. OK. And when you go into that word, the highways, let me let me point this out, man. All right. And then we'll close it out. All right. Oops. So like you go back. You go into that word in the interliner, okay? You go into that word highways, all right? You you see um, you see the word there, but let's go into the uh, let's see. I think it's this one. Um, let's do it this way. Let's do it this way. Exodus twenty-two and nineteen. All right. Exodus 22 and 19. Let's go into the way. All right. Let's go into the view, view usage. Right. Matthew 22. Matthew 22 and verse 9. So like a 19. All right. You see right at the top. St. Matthew chapter 22 verse 9. Go ye therefore into the highways. Right. You go into that word, the highways, guess what? The Greek word is also hados, okay? The way, all right? All right? Yahweh Shai, okay? Because Yahweh Shai is the way, all right? It says, go ye therefore 
into the highways, okay? The way of Yahweh Shai, man, okay? So, this, so, 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 if, so if you come across a camp or a group of guys or whatever that, that, that are, you know, in their basements or in a, you know, a, 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 um, in their homes, right? And never going out into the highways and hedges or, you know, taking seasons off. The scriptures tell us to be in, in season and out of season, man, okay? Constantly doing the work, constantly building, okay? Just like in the times of Noah, man. Noah constantly built, okay? Until it rained, man, okay? Until the day of judgment, until the day of destruction, man, okay? And that's exactly what we're doing today, just like in the days of Noah, okay? You see? But that's the way, all right? That's that's the way of Yahweh Shai, man, okay? That's walking in the way of Yahweh Shai, all right? Go ye therefore into the highways, all right? And as many as ye find... Bid, bid to the marriage, okay? That's the brothers, you know, uh, um, we've came across the brothers, okay? I myself have came across the brothers out there on the highways and hedges in the way of Yahweh Shai, okay? Bidding men to the marriage, okay? I, I myself got bid to the marriage by these men, okay? You see, through the spirit and power of Yahweh Shai, all right? Verse 10, it says, so those servants, all right, the men, of Yahweh Shai went out in the highways, all right, or in the way, all right, of Yahweh Shai, right, and gathered together all as many as they found, all right, both bad and good, okay. That, th those are the men that, you know, the, the uh, good men that have stayed, the men that you see that have, you know, traveled many years in his truth, have, 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 have much uh, wisdom and experience in his truth, right. 10, 15, 20 years plus, right? And then the bad, right? Which are the men that probably have been around for 5, 10, 15 years, you know? Some men have been around five days, five months, right? And then have fell out the truth, man, okay? The Lord took those men and casted them back, you know, into the water, man, okay? The sea of men, the sea of the dead, all right? <laughs> you see? It says... And the wedding was furnished with guests, okay? All right? So, you know, Yahweh Shai is the way, man, okay? All right? And once again, if you say you're in the truth, all right, then you have to be tapped into Yahweh Shai because what? Yahweh Shai is the way. So I'm going to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rechach Wadash, Shalom, and the Bible Ball.